Hi guys, 6th of June 2023. I had a dream last night. Don't remember all of it. I remember some of it and I'm going to share that with you here. Yesterday, before the dream, I was going to do a video and say, come on, let's get our community sorted out. You need to get your community sorted out. And you need to get it established and you need to get plans in place and you need to be getting ready. Like really seriously and I had this dream and what I remember of it was there was me and there was a couple of other Christians but a few of us literally moping around in the physical darkness again physical darkness like pitch black and it was like obliviation mate it was just total destruction everywhere <coughs> total destruction and I'm literally just moping around trying to survive um, and this dream was a big and long dream but this is what I remember of it I remember other details but I don't remember it very well so I'm not going to share and then I wake up this morning <laughs> to a notification on my phone about AI you know you might have heard about AI and they're saying that if people don't start regulating AI around the world that within two years, two years, AI could could produce mass weapons of destruction that haven't been created yet that humans would find very hard to control. Are you hearing this? Two years. It's 23, 24, 25. All right, things are getting bad, man. Things are hyping up. We live in very serious times. You need to get your community up and running. I mean, like this is like a desperate call. It's a desperate plea with you to get ready, right? And you need to. You really need to be thinking. Watching this, right? You really need to be thinking, right? You're a Christian, right? We've had, we have warnings of what is coming. You know, you shouldn't just be in the mindset of sitting here watching this, thinking. Oh well, another interesting video and just cracking on with your day. You you know, no, no, I'm telling you, man. Like, I'm telling you. Like, this is like a desperate plea with you. You need to get ready. Because if you don't... <sighs> it's not good. You know, I look around, man, like today, beautiful sunny day. And you can't see it because the camera's facing me, but it's beautiful. This is all going to change soon, man. It's just going to be darkness everywhere and destruction everywhere. It's coming in my mind about Ukraine, you know. You surely heard about Ukraine. People just mind their own business, living their lives, and suddenly, bang, war upon them. Do you know what I mean? And now they're living very di different lives. You know? Christian communities are free, right, they're free, it's not a case of me coming on here and saying, oh, there's land in the Ozarks, America, it costs $10,000 for you to be a part of it, no, it's free, the Christian communities are free, you can join a community near you and talk with others for free, and some of the Christian communities at the moment have pre-selected safe locations. We've already done the hard work for you along with like admins and stuff in the past and we've selected land that we consider safe but you need to pray about it, right? So you've got a digital community set up like right now, right now for the majority of us, right? Well, most of us, especially in America and the UK. Um, but like even like Germany has a safe location. You know, I'm not gonna name it here, but it has a safe location. I think there's a couple in Australia, like you know, there are safe locations pre-selected already in different parts of the earth. Alright? But even if you don't have even if there is not a pre-selected safe location already, the manual, the Christian community's manual talks you through and guides you in how to find a safe location and back up safe locations. Right. But the point is, is the communities are free, 
there are pre-selected safe locations already existing right this second and you can literally hop into a community and chat with other Christians and start planning and preparing together now. Now remember you've got the manual, you've got essential survival skills and you've got your planner to help you, right? Those three books is not $10,000. If anything, it probably works out about $50, $60, I don't know. But that is nothing compared to like the $10,000. But look, you need to understand, right? The books are optional, but they're there to help you. But you can easily get onto a community right now. And even if others don't join you right now, you can talk to your family, your friends in your local area and add them into your community like right now. There's nothing stopping you. Like you can join a community near you, pre-selected, and you can turn around to like your husband, your wife. You could turn around to your children. You could turn around to your friends. You know, you could turn around to extended family around you. You can say to your church, there is a community. You can add them all in and say, right, we need to plan. There's the safe location. You know, when, when crap goes down, all of us here, we meet at safe location. Set up a camp. As you know, right now I'm working through playlists to help you. So we've covered vehicle survival, preparedness for disasters. All right, that's done now. We're about to move into on-foot survival. So I'm teaching you the real skills that you need to survive. All right. I'm going to set up a new playlist called Food. It goes along with essential survival skills. On the back of essential survival skills, it has your essential skills. I'm going to cover food. I'm going to cover MREs. All right. So I'm going to do that just before I hop into the on foot survival playlist but i'm doing everything i possibly can to help you but you need to see the seriousness of, of this you need to understand this you need to grasp the magnitude of this you need to understand what is coming all right and we are running out of time all right please understand this this is a real call to you a real plea you need to get ready all right and most of the hard work has been done for you all right <coughs> join your community Create awareness of your community. Add others in. Have a plan in place. Right? Once you've got your plan in place, once you've got your kit sorted out, your food, water supplies, you know exactly where you're going. You know, you essentially can just sort of leave your plan and your kit in the background and carry on with your life as normal. But when crap goes down, one message to your community. Let's go, guys. Safe location now. Get there. Get your camp set up. And also plan and have a few... Uh, backup safe locations in place all right this is really 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 serious like please try to understand this all right really serious man and uh you know i care about you i love you all right i don't want you to suffer i don't want you to be in the darkness that's coming and the destruction all around us and suffering on your own when you don't have to why would you not Put a basic plan in place, man. Do you know what I mean? Like, you don't have to suffer. Please do not choose suffering. And please do not put your planning and preparing off until destruction hits. Be too late then. All right? We need to get ready together now. All right? In the description below, first link, join the Christian communities. Below that, it's the books that will help you. I wrote these books to help you, all right? Manual, personal planner, essential survival skills. Start with your manual first, all right? <coughs> Please prepare. Please pray about everything that I've shared in this video with you. Join the communities, join a community near you. The manual guides you through what to do. Please, all right? I don't want you to suffer. Please. I want you moping around in the darkness when it comes and the destruction. No, please. I love you. Please prepare. Please get ready. Please pray about everything in this video. I love you guys. You be safe.